how we're doing. Well, I've got eight minutes and 33 seconds to get a video in. Right, I'm brewing a brew. It's Thursday night. Twenty fours on the go. I've got a manual because I quite figured out how to set up all the gubbings and I'm doing a Belgium. We just turn this uh, if I get copyrighted to death. Bit of cold cox there. I don't own the rights to it. Those who know, who know. Um, yeah, so I'm brewing a Belgium basically. Um, just a pale, just a base malt, a bit of crystal in there, and some be be Belgium yeast. I'm also putting in, I've cut the bloody lid off of that. I think it's SARS. SARS. How? Ers. Oh, well, I think that's it. We did that the wrong way round, I know. So, yeah, just doing a got finished off early because my van apparently had no MOT on it and I was bring it back as I was off. Been driving around for a month without it apparently. There you go. So yeah, um a little bit as it's going. Um aiming for about four percent ish beer. I'm gonna possibly chuck some marmalade in it. I haven't decided yet. Just give it that little bit of an orangey, citrusy kind of thing, go well with the hops. I am currently drinking a brew dog. I've got some uh, Tesco's and uh, did some juice for £7.50, selling 15 quid because the box got wet. I was like, so I bought three boxes. Chicken bloody dinner! Oh, and he dropped my can then. So yeah, so um, I'm into it, I'm probably, I started off um, about half hour ago, so I'm halfway through the brew, I'm only doing a 60 minute. Um, little man cave's a bit of a thing like, the vinyl is getting in the way. I did pick up some today, um, vinyl, on the way home, paid 20 quid for a box full of 7 inch, and... There was a couple in there, Rolling Stones ones, and one of them was worth, it's worth 130 bloody quid. Chicken bloody dinner. We, uh, get in there. Got the big eater out. It's, uh, the reason why I got my cap on, because I keep touching it, I keep singeing my hair off. And the smell's not good, and I ain't got a lot of hair as it is. But, um, I've got the, um, Belgium kit beer over there. So I'm going to bring it out tomorrow and I'm going to leave it out overnight so it just chills it down and cold crash it in for a couple of nights as the elements allow and then I'm going to keg that up possibly over the weekend or Monday. Um, a couple of kit brews that I kegged up a couple last week or a couple of weeks ago I'm going to dump them because I sucked all the sediment up and it's just... It's a pain in the arse and they look like ditch water and they are proper murky and don't taste great so that's probably the last time I'll buy a kit brew or Wilco style. They just, they just not that good really are they? Um, so you know it's, it is what it is but yeah it's a, it's a Thursday, it's not a Wednesday. It's a, I wasn't a brew one to do it yesterday but I didn't get back in time. I was on the tools. Oh, I tell you, it's fucking freezing, man! Look out there. Look how close the moon is. That is well close. Honest. So, yeah, um, got a bit of sorting out to do. A few fermenters. A stainless steel one down there. Probably going to move it on. And I am going to actually try and get the grain file, a conical fermenter, up and running eventually. Because I've got to move on. Plastic buckets. Oh, I bought a new mixer the other day as well. It's a uh, Newmark 5000 FX. There you go. Didn't pay a lot for it. It's pretty decent. Just what it says on the tin. Um, but yeah, um, Wilco's. I've, I went to Wilco's today and they've now got a uh, dark berry 
cider kit and I'm assuming it's supposed to be similar to the Strongbow Dark Fruits, whatever it is. Spoke to the wife and she's like, oh yeah, I'm interested in that. 20 quid. She's like, oh, I'm not interested in that anymore. I think 40 pints of 20 quid is, what's up with you? Uh, but yeah, anyway, I'll, I'll sort it out. I might get one myself. I might do a, a, a video on that soon. I'm hoping to get to Brewers Select pretty soon as well. Uh, payday Friday. So I'm going to put an order in. <clears throat> get myself a couple of bags of grain because I'm getting a bit low. Um, other than that, just a bit of vinyl picked up there. A bit of vinyl picked up there. A bit of vinyl picked up everywhere, to be honest. And then with a, I think that's going to be a new venture in life. Is On the side of what I'm doing, current thing is... I'm going to set up my little own vinyl selling thing because uh, I've got so much of it now and I did want to build up a good bunch of it. I mean, anybody want some uh, disco? I've got 300 or so there. Not something cheap, honest. So, yeah, it's um, Thursday night and we're freezing my tits off. So, yeah, I'm going to. Uh, Carry on with this brew. Uh, I may do a single hop as well. Not, that's it. So hopefully that will be a uh, reasonably good beer. And then if it is, I have got some bottles laying around. Who knows? I might actually get round to doing some beer mail for the first time in probably three years. Um, stay lucky. Catch yours. <laughs>